Hello dear subscribers and visitors of my YouTube channel Retro Photo House. I just wanted to record um, just a quick video explaining one useful feature of Jupiter 9 uh, portrait lens. Uh, sometimes people asking what's, what is wrong with lens because I'm sending Jupiter 9 to my customers and I, they are saying why the ring is reversed in some uh, in some way so uh, just I will uh, aperture ring just I will show how to work with preset aperture feature on Jupiter 9 prime lens so basically there is two rings here one with the clicks And another one that moves aperture blades like this you see so how it works basically for example if you need to work at f4 aperture value you select your value with the external ring with this one where there are aperture markings you select your value then you focus it wide open because it's more easily and then without even uh, needing to watch on the aperture ring you just turn this ring counterclockwise like this to until stop and you need you know for sure that your lens is stopped to desired aperture value in our case is f at 4 you see like this hop it stops the ring and you you know that you will shoot at f at 4 for example if you need to shoot at f 2.8 you select your value you focus and then you can look into your viewfinder or into your LCD ecran. You just turn the ring like this and you know that you will stop at your desired aperture value. Like this, hop. And you have f, point, f at 2.8. And the same thing for 8, for example, here. You have your 8, you focus onto at wide open. So you turn the ring, you have your 8 value, 5.6 five, 5 the same thing, 4 the same thing, 2 the same thing. So it's really useful feature, especially when you shoot film or just uh, DSLR cameras. So. This is how it works. Thank you for your attention. Goodbye.